now getting the bikes away and getting the GTR in the center because of the rain that is going on right now. The GTR is now ready to get the Vossen HF5 custom ordered wheels installed. And to do that, of course, Tread Connection, the only place I trust actually doing my wheels because they will do it without ever putting a scratch or dent or anything damaging on the wheels. They did it on my Supra and they came out flawless. And I'll go ahead and show you the uh, stock rims that we have sitting right here. This is a rear, got the front one in the box. They're not in the most perfect shape. There's a few little dings on the edges. It might be hard to see on camera but these have had, I think, four sets of tires on them through the life of this car. I've done technically two sets. Previous owner, of course, put a few on it. But I have a few other goodies from Vossen, so I have two different hubcaps. I'm gonna go ahead and just stick with these ones for right now. They are color match bronze, so that is gonna look really good on the actual bronze wheel. And then eventually, I'm going to swap them over to these ones, and this is the color that I'm gonna end up doing my calipers. I think that's gonna look super cool. And then some other goodies we have from Boston. I got locking lugs and then a whole set of lug nuts, really nice black, much nicer looking than stock. And then taking a look at these sizes again, if you missed yesterday's video, we got 20 by 10s and 20 by 11s. And we have plus 25 offset for the fronts and then plus five for the rears. And then another look at the wheels if anybody missed them. And I am weighing these as well. So I'll have that later in the video. But just another look at them looking so sick as the box closes itself up. But they're gonna look so good. But now, let's go ahead, and I'm not gonna show you guys that just yet, but let's go ahead and see how Trek Connection gets these things on. a good cinematic of how they installed the front and as you can see it's on the car now so here's why you need to definitely contact Trek Connection for anything like this obviously those are expensive wheels and I want them perfect not that I'm a picky person but when you spend a lot of money on wheels you want them perfect and regardless if you like a car you want your wheels to not get damaged so the way they do this obviously putting this on the tire machine this piece right here goes in and nothing is touching the actual rim it is right into the center hub there and locked in place and then as you guys just saw, that wheel just went around here and pushed it right off the bead. And then this is the important piece right there. That little thing is gonna hook around the whole tire and literally pull it right off. See that pop oh, yeah. And then now is when we get to the really, really important part. We got the Boston wheel ready to go and ready to have the tire mounted onto it. This part is where um, a lot of people will use metal tire irons to help this process, and that's when you get chips and damage. So these wheels, as you guys are gonna see, installing it just like we did the other one. And then to put it on, you can see that thing's gonna keep it away from the actual rim, and then that wheel is basically gonna pull it around, and then this piece as well. So no metal tools are touching the rim ever. And aside from the grease, you can see there's nothing at all on the rim. Everything is flawless. And then we just fill it up with air. The actual tools they're using too, this has a plastic coating or a cover around the actual socket. So the inside of the rims, again, nothing is gonna get scratched up. And if we take a look at my factory wheels, you can see some scratch marks in here. This is from uh, many different shops and myself taking these off. They're all scratched up on the inside and it might be hard to see the lip but like I showed earlier, there are a few chips on some of my rims 
from Metal Tire Iron. Let's see if this rear one that they just took off, you can see these chips right here. And some of them happened when I got these tires originally mounted, and that was the shop using Metal Tire Irons to install them. And you don't want that if you love your car, you know, if you spend a lot of money on wheels, you obviously don't want anything like that. So I'll have Tri Connection down below. Check them out. They're super mobile. They come to your house, come to your work. I'm literally at home chilling, and they're coming here super conveniently and getting my wheels knocked out. They did the same thing on the Supra, but I'll have these guys linked down below. Pretty much the whole Charlotte area up to Hickory. Uh, they have a lot of areas in the central North Carolina area, and then I think they're nationwide as well. But comment down below. What do you guys think of the Boston wheels? How do you think they're looking? I think they look insane. This side's kind of dark for you guys to see. But oh my gosh, the color is literally spot on, exactly what I was looking for. Oh my gosh, I am excited. All right, and then the final is installing the Vossen lug nuts. I love them finish off in black. Super nice attention to detail with the engraving and everything. But look at that, plus five offset. We are looking so flush, I cannot wait to get this completely out on the ground. All right, and with that side torqued to spec, I'm gonna stick with the powder coated bronze uh, center caps. Just get them nice in line with the Vossen logo right there. And that is completed. Shout out to Tread Connection. Seriously, check them out. As you guys can tell, there isn't even an issue. No scratches, nothing on the wheel whatsoever. So that is why these guys are where it's at. So check out them in the description below. And then Boston wheels, oh, they look so sick. Let's get it out. It finally stopped raining, so let's go see what this thing looks like. Remember in yesterday's video when I said the GTR didn't feel too fast? I need to rematch this against the Supra with this down one gear using the rolling launch control. I just did a second gear, 30 mile an hour in this car. This is gonna destroy this uh, the Supra. <laughs> I am losing my train of thought, but watch how quick second gear is in this car using rolling launch control. That is fast, like that is no turbo lag. <laughs> and that was instant, just oh my gosh. At least we know these Boston wheels are handling the power really well. Let's do another one of those rolling launches. As I would a dead thing in the road, but man oh man. Alright, let's check these things out. All right, first maiden voyage in the GTR with the new wheels. Drives nice and smooth. The factory TPMS connected back to normal and uh, air pressure's looking good. But now, wow, two years and nine months I've owned this car and I've been wanting to do this ever since then. So let's check it out. a good look at the new HF5 wheels from Boston sitting on the GTR. Comment down below, what do you guys think of them? I love them, I love the color, it is exactly what I was going for. And then the concavity that these things have, the really deep dish, that plus five offset in the rear, just looks super sweet. I love how deep they look. Just get a really good look at everything with the coloring. And then I really even like them against the calipers. That looks really good. Already dirty though, of course, but uh, <laughs> Oh man, they are looking good. The Michelin wheels look really good on them. Then sitting up front, 
nicely fitting and then no rubbing or anything like that obviously the tire is the exact same we're just poking out a little bit more than factory but that is looking sweet so I think that's gonna wrap it up for today's video, putting the new Vossen wheels on the GTR. I've been wanting wheels for so long, and I think I picked the perfect setup. Shout out to my friends at Trike Connection for knocking this out at my house. And well, the wheels are perfect condition, which is exactly what you want. So definitely I recommend them if you have any nice wheels, or if you just care about your car in general, or care about convenience, that is super nice. And then Vossen wheels, they have so many awesome wheels, and the GTR definitely looks awesome. So Diego at Vossen, thank you so much for hooking me up and helping me out with the sizing. He owns a GTR, so he knew exactly what specs. So it was really easy to get the exact set I wanted and then get the fitment perfect to fit the stock wheels. And then eventually when I go bigger tires, these will still fit. So that's really nice that I can kind of have that flexibility to then change out tires and have wider tires as well. But that's gonna wrap it up guys. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Give it a thumbs up, smash the subscribe button if videos like this are things you like to see. And I'll see you guys next video.